Hey everybody, Scalcraft here again. Well, it's here, it's finally here, July 3rd, the Clamp Challenge Day to be revealed. And uh, if you can see behind me, we have the uh, nice example of the American flag. That's the 27th official version. There were 26 versions before this one, the one you see behind me. And uh, it has quite a history to it, but um, let's take a look at uh, how, this, how my clamp started off. Remember, I started with a different clamp and changed my mind. Let's go to that footage and see how it started okay, off. Okay, here we are, second attempt at the clamp challenge. The first attempt didn't work out too good. So let's try this one. Um, this one here, I did, I cleaned it up, just wire brushed it last year, put a coat of shellac on. That's what I do when I get rusty clamps. I, I clean them up, hang them up. And uh, this one here would be, I think, a good candidate for it. However, I would like to keep this area here silver and then do the colors in there. So let's get to it, see how this one works out. Now on our modern flag, the stripes represent the original 13 colonies and the stars represent the 50 states of the Union. The colors of the flag are symbolic as well. The red symbolizes hardiness and valor the white symbolizes purity and innocence, and the blue represents vigilance, perseverance, and justice. Okay, first off, before we get to the clamp, I just want to say one thing. Uh, I put out this challenge because it was not just a challenge for you, but it was a challenge for me too. Painting has never been my strong point, and, and I know that's the same with a lot of you. And uh, doing this challenge really uh, helps us to uh, become better painters. Now, for some of you, I could see by your entries, painting is your strong point. And I was blown away by the entries. I have to tell you, the quality was amazing. As you will see at the end of this video, I'm going to couple some of the photos. And, and also in the links down below, um, I will couple anybody that put up a video on the Scout Crafter Challenge, the Clamp Challenge. I will have their link below. So I encourage you to go check out their channels and uh, and check out the beautiful job they did on their clamps. It's just amazing. So uh, let's get to what I did. Okay, and here's my entry to the clamp challenge. And uh, what I did was uh, I did it up exactly the way I was hoping to do it. Um, I basically did, you know, a red, white, and blue pattern, you know, because of our flag here in the United States. And um, what I did with the stars, there were 13 stars representing the original 13 colonies. And again, there were 13 stripes alternating, again, uh, representing the original 13 colonies. And um, what I did with the stars is I would paint the entire clamp white, and then I would uh, put these sticker stars on, spray it blue, and then pull the stickers off. And that would leave a, a nice uh, a finish there. And then obviously with the, uh, the red stripes too, once the whole clamp was painted white, I uh, painted the, the uh, red stripes with the uh, masked off. And then I uh, peeled off the masking tape revealing the stripes. Now, uh, after it's all done, you know, so you don't have any kind of... Uh, um, transitional bumps between the paint I clear coated with two coats of clear coat the entire clamp so you don't see any transition you see in the light there uh, you don't see any transition between the stars so it's all it looks like it was factory done but uh, this is a I really enjoy this clamp I enjoy this uh, this color scheme and uh, it was a real fun challenge and I hope you had as much fun as I did doing now this. let's take a look at some of the other entries the fantastic entries from all over.
so in closing, I want to thank everybody for participating in this uh, uh, patriotic sea clam challenge. The entries were over the top fantastic. And uh, just remember, with every project, we get better. And if you don't believe me, look at some of my early videos and you'll see. And everybody else, it only takes a short time before you uh, go from mediocre work to, to doing something that you're proud of. So thanks so much for tuning in. I hope you have a nice holiday. Take care now. Bye-bye.